Hello, everyone. Hi. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on Thanksgiving Eve. Hi, Connie. Hey, Jill. Hey, Miss Gina. Long time. No. <laughs> hey, Birdie. Oh, getting snowflakes. Oh, snowflakes. That's a little exciting. I wish we could get raindrops. I know, right? We're just getting hot weather. Hot weather. That's all we have. Hot, hot, hot. Uh, it's all like time, one hot. season here now. <laughs> hot. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Well, good to see you guys. Thank you guys so hey, much Janet. for joining us on this new time. Um, it was a bit rushed for us. I don't yes. know about you guys, yes. but for us, we were a bit rushed. But we are here and so happy to be and here. That was, that's all that counts, right? That's it. We're here with our friends. That's it. Hi, Janet. Hi, Lini. Hi, Mary Jane. Yes, happy Thanksgiving yes. Eve. That's right. Exactly. That's right. So my friends, hello Miriam, welcome. Um, so let me go ahead and just start by um, jumping right in, right? Um, we have a lot that's going on and I just realized I didn't, look at the black camera thing on the on my screen. You guys probably oh. see a black shadow by Lynn. Sorry, I didn't adjust that camera Well, proper. this one, do you want me to move it a little bit? That's okay. Is it this one? I think, I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, I don't think it's up. I don't know. It's we're, a mystery. We are just going to, we're on the fly, as Lynn says yes. today. We are just working things on the fly. So my friends, first things first. Hi, Deborah. Hi, Pam. Hey, Rosalie. Welcome, everyone. We have our holiday party, virtual holiday party, coming up Saturday, December 18th at 4 p.m., and um, we are going to have a lot of fun stuff going on. So I'm just going to change it back so you guys can kind of see us and we can talk about it. But just wanted to show you what that is all about. And um, we are going to be having um, an ugly COVID mask contest. I'm and already I'm, planning. That. I know. So I'm already jealous I'm because excited. she's already planning. She's already like getting it together. And I'm sitting here humming and hawing what should I do <laughs> <laughs> I think it's gonna be so fun how cute it'll be a lot of fun something different rather than an ugly sweater we did that last year it was a, that was a lot of fun that though. was a lot of fun um, I remember we're gonna the do, winner she, she yeah, was all out she, she decked out yeah. yeah so we're gonna do an ugly COVID mask contest so make sure you guys start getting ready start planning your ugly mask yeah right and so have fun with it I know it'll be fun um, and then we're going to showcase our most favorite one project of 2021. Yes, because some people, we won't mention names, Lini, <laughs> have a million projects. So, you know, the mic is right there, there, right? Oh, sorry, Lini. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Lini knows we're kidding. Yes. She knows we love her. Yes. Um, hey, Nancy. Hi, and Kathy. Kathy. Two Kathy's. Oh, there's Kathy Shay. To Kathy, so welcome, welcome. So yes, your favorite project of 2021. You're gonna feature, and we'll go ahead and spotlight the camera on you, and so everybody can really see your project. It'll be fun. It'll yeah, be a lot of fun. Tell's show and tell Show and tell is always fun. And of course, yes. Look, she hears <laughs> you. <laughs> yes, she does. Yes. Um, and then of course we will do door prizes and and play some more games. So it'll just be a lot of fun. Just a social hour. Bring your favorite um, cocktail or beverage that you like and just hang out with us. Yes, have fun. And have fun. So that is on Saturday, December 18th. And at what time does the party start? 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Okay, 4 p.m. Oh, and you must register. So there's a couple of ways to register. You can register on my website or you can register. There's a Google link and then you just fill out the questionnaire and you can register that way. So either way gets you registered. There's no charge. I just need to know who to send the Zoom invite to. All right. Then the next thing, I'm gonna go ahead and change cameras for a little bit. We have this new event coming up. It's a virtual event. Hi, Jeannie, welcome. Um, a new virtual event and it's by OESD and it's quick and easy gifts. So it's perfect for this time of year. It's Thursday, December 9th at 12 noon Pacific. And so you guys are gonna be learning how to make some really quick um, gifts for the holidays, and it'll be a lot of fun. So um, I'm not sure if this is on my website just yet. We just got this in, so I wanted you guys to know about it. So if it is, um, 
you guys can certainly sign up for it. There's no charge. If it isn't, just give us a day or two and we'll get it up there. Oh, hey, Pam, you did make it home on time. I love it. Thank you. Okay, so that's that. And then I actually have samples of my Punny Valentine, the embroidery event that's coming up. So let me bring those samples out. So look at this, you guys. Is this not adorable? It's a sunglass case. And look at the glitter. And then there's vinyl as well. I don't know if you guys can see that with the glare of the light. Um, but it's super cute. So you can put your sunglasses all made in the hoop. So this is one of the projects. And then look at the quilting design, Lynn. It's like really, really cute. cute. And the stitching around is Yeah, really it's very cute. I don't know if they can, let me see if I can zoom in very maybe. Detailed. There we go. Maybe that's a little bit better. You guys can kind of see that, right? And then we have these gift cards. Now these are super cute. So we put our little business card in there, but imagine just putting a gift card for a special somebody and giving that as a gift. And these are made with felt and then they've got some like their leather and all kinds of fun stuff so that is project number two and project number three is this um it's an oh, apron so now cute. i'm gonna have to zoom back out here so look at this first of all it's on this pink leather and look at the cupcake i love this part yeah, of it, the silver really cute. um and it is a towel converted into an apron but look at the detail on this truck this is the pocket and look at the this is the pocket here and look at the detail i mean it's Amazing. fabulous yeah it's fabulous and there's more leather here and i love the metallic thread so that's going to be project three Hey, Elaine. Hey, Laurel. Welcome. So three super cute projects um, for my punny Valentine. And then this one is going to be on January 8th. There's no date on here, but I remember the date. And it's virtual. And it's virtual. Yes, um, it is virtual. January 8th. Okay, so that's that. And then I have, let's get these out of the way here. And then I have a table runner to show you. This is, whoops, this is um, the next Embroidery Club project. So this is a table runner. You can see it's going and going and going. You see one end. And so this, there's a clever technique here, and I'm not going to really tell you the clever technique because you need to sign up for this class <laughs> to, to get it, but it's really cool. Lini and I were kind of like, wow, how clever. Um, but most importantly, um, you're learning how to combine the designs, right, and do a continuous embroidery. So really cute. Um, there's another little twist to that. And this is, oh, thank you, Lini. This is January's project. That's right, let me not jump ahead here. This is our first embroidery club project for 2022. So it's the first Friday of January in 2022. Um, I don't know what the date is. Maybe Lini can type that in for me. Um, so this is gonna be a lot of fun. The one for December are the pashmina shawls, um, but that one, um, I can't take any more signups because we had to order shawls and it's a whole process. Some shawls didn't even arrive and it's just a process, but we're good. We're all good for um, the December. December class and then this is for January. So I wanted to show that today. And what else? Do I have anything else to show? I know, what are you doing for Thanksgiving? I am going to my parents' house. Nice. Yeah. Yeah, nice. just going to hang out. Oh, perfect. There we go, January Pam. 7th. January 7th Thanks, Pam. is the Embroidery Club, and then January 8th is the um, My Penny Valentine. Oh, back to back. Back fun. to back. Fun. fun, fun, fun. Yeah, what are you doing? It's only going to be four of us, and I'm not too into turkey, so we're having barbecued steak. But, but there's more, yes. There's you got to tell them what you're doing. So I like to plan extra activities. And the last time we got together, which was, I don't know, a couple years ago, right? Mm -hmm. We made napkins. We sewed napkins. And this year we're going to sew pillowcases. So when you say we, who's we? Like everybody? So Even the, the guys? Yeah, the guys. My That's nephew, really my cool. friend, and my sister. But this year I think I'll sew with them. Oh, last year you didn't sew? You were no, just the boss? No, last time. Yeah, I just 
crack you just that crank whip the whip. Got yeah. it. Did they finish? Yeah, they did. Did they have fun? Well, I think so. <laughs> I posted a video on Facebook. So this year we're going to do the pillowcases, and we are going to do French seams. So there's no raw edges on the inside. It'll be fun. That sounds like a lot of fun. And we did it on a fast, fun Friday. Yes, yes, yeah. we did. Yeah, really cool. Well, that'll be fun. You gotta I think tell me so. how it goes. Yeah, I'll <laughs> post a video on Facebook. Will they let you post a video? Yeah. They, they don't know. They won't. They won't. What they know. don't know won't hurt them. Okay. We'll secretly film them. Okay. If we'll they say bad it. words, though, I won't post <laughs> it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. So, yeah, it'll be fun. So, just to kind of recap what's going on here at the store. Um, so today is today, and tomorrow is Thanksgiving, so Friday. Friday is Black Friday, so we are having our Black Friday sale here in the store. Um, unfortunately, our website is kind of tricky where we can't, um, it's kind of complicated to put certain specials on our website, so we're just doing it really in the store. For Black Friday, um, we have um, $6 a yard fabric for one piece of fabric. Um, so one piece, one yard, $6. And then um, we've got all kinds of other deals here in the store. So yeah, you guys need to come, come on in us. and check us out. So that's Black Friday. And then on, on Saturday, which is Small Business Saturday, and that's both in store and online, we are doing, um, if you buy gift certificates, you get a fat quarter bundle. Oh, yeah. I didn't know about that one. Yeah, That's fun. really cool, really cool. That's so fun. fat quarter bundles with gift certificates. And then, let me see if I can remember this correct. Then on sat Saturday, no, that was Saturday. Then Sorry. on Monday, it's Cyber Monday. And we are doing another gift certificate promotion as well. So a right. couple of different things going on. We're super excited about them. So I hope you guys will partake in them. It'll be fun. Hey, Sandy, welcome. Um, Laurel, yes, Embroidery Club for December are the Pashminas. We just got the box in today. So um, I'm assuming you want yours shipped out. So we will ship it out on Friday. It'll go out on Friday. Um, now, for those of you who have signed up for the December Embroidery Club, you may not get all of the ones. Some of you ordered multiple shawls, so I just, whatever they had in stock, I just got. I ordered everything, and then when I got an email after the fact, of course, after mm. the fact, that they only had certain ones in stock. So I'll email, I mean, I'll send out or I'll put aside whatever you can do for your club, and then I may owe you some pashminas later, right? So you guys can make some more shawls after the right. fact. But at least for a club, you'll you'll have enough to. Yeah, they'll make nice Christmas presents. They'll be fabulous Christmas gifts. So, okay. Do we, should we tell them our favorite colors? <laughs> no. For Pashimas. No. <laughs> Everybody okay. knows my favorite yeah, color. Yeah, they do know they your know. favorite color. They know. What's yeah. your favorite color? Do I know I your favorite know. color? I have a lot of favorite colors. That's a problem. Um, you have a lot of favorite colors. Mm-hmm. I do lot. like red. But that's not your Some favorite. Some things I like orange. Are you a blue kind of person? Mm. How about purple? Mm. Oh. Not so much. Okay. So more maybe, red. Maybe. I'm more red. Oh, no yeah. wonder we get along. Yeah. There you go. Red's <laughs> our color. <laughs> um, there is a starting price on the gift cards. I don't remember what it is off the top, Deborah. Um, I think it's $50. Or maybe it's 25 it's it's mm. low it's 25 or 50 so okay all right I'm gonna go to Shall the we? station oh there's the sirens never fails triple-a sirens or PCH they're, they're sirens alerting everyone to our I know right all right so Lynn's off to her station we're gonna go ahead and flip the cameras here in just a little bit and we will get started hey Barbara so we are going to start here today with end of bolt. End of bolt. So that's how we're starting. And then we've got some fun new notions to show you as well. Um, all right, so where am I starting with Lynn right here? Okay, so it's, again, it's just Lynn and myself today. Rayan was coming in. He said he was coming in. 
and then he decided to go off and hang out with his dad and brother today. I look, see, Rayan's in, Rayan in the house. See, I was just say, talking about Rayan. So oh, he was Rayan coming in. No, Bertie is asking. He was coming in, and then he decided, they just texted me a couple of hours ago, they were going to go to, um, so for those of you who are local, there is the K1 Speed, um, where you just drive race cars around. You know, they're so into cars, these two boys. Oh, my goodness. So they must have talked my husband into taking them to K1 Speed because they're there, <laughs> racing away. So, okay. So we are doing end of bolt, my friends, and so the price is $8.99 a yard, and you must take everything that's on the bolt. So this one here is fabric number one, and it's three and a quarter yards of fabric. So three and a quarter yards. I know, he was super excited to come today, actually. He's like, oh, I haven't been there in a while. It'll be fun to see everybody. And I'm like, yes, they're looking forward to seeing you, too. And then look. K1 well, speed one. He got a better offer. He got a better offer or he, yeah, I don't know what he did, how he finagled that one. So here is fabric number one. So you'll have to excuse our numbers today. We don't have the, the pinned numbers, but I hope you guys can see that, right? Fabric number one. And then fabric number two. So fabric number two is two and three eighths yard of fabric two and three-eighths yards of fabric. It's a beautiful green. So are you guys all ready for Thanksgiving? I don't cook for Thanksgiving. I normally just always end up at my parents' house or they come over. And when they came over, they, I still don't cook. <laughs> you don't want me to cook a turkey. That wouldn't be a good thing. So number three, um, can you see the numbers then, or does it look like there's a glare? That one is hard to read. Hmm. All right, well, this is number three, and this is two yards. Fabric number two, I mean, fabric number three, two yards. I love this print. Look how wild it is. It's like brush strokes. Oh, I love it. It's totally like brush strokes. And then we have fabric number four, which is a cotton, and it's a plaid, though. It's like so fun. Um, fabric number four is a yard and three-eighths. So one and three-eighths. Oh, Nancy used it for a backing. I love it. Oh, yeah, that's a good idea because it, um, it's so many everything colors. Will blend yeah, in. everything will blend in, your quilting will blend in, all that. So, absolutely. Then we have stuff that's done in primary level. <laughs> <laughs> Elaine, <laughs> you crack me up. Elaine and her stories. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god that's hilarious oh my goodness you crack me up that's funny sorry you didn't mean to embarrass you oh that's funny so Elaine thought the sirens were from the street and they were actually from PCH because she was driving you're in the wrong one. Oh, am I in the wrong order? Yeah. Oh, sorry. I, I jumped. I jumped ship. This one. I jumped ship. Sorry. I went from four to nine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even paying attention. I'm talking. It's okay. I got sidetracked by the I by Elaine's. I'm caffeine, so I'm good. I got sidetracked by Elaine's story. I know that so this, my friend, is a cork fabric, and this here is not a cork fabric. It's a cork-looking fabric. And it's the brown cork looking fabric with the um, gold speckle. So it's super fun. Two and a quarter yards and it's number five. Two and a quarter yards and number five. I don't think we can write on paper no, anymore. We can't, do this we can't write on paper anymore. You know what I'm gonna do? Hang on my friends. Give me a second. Oh. There you go. You get the... Now we know it doesn't work. 
Yeah, now we know writing on paper doesn't work. We thought we were we were saving our set because you know what it is, right? We closed the store at five, and we were oh, three. I mean three. We were scrambling. <laughs> we were swamped. We were swamped. So fabric number five, two and a quarter. Fabric number five, two and a quarter. Okay, so fabric number six. Fabric number six is this guy right here, and it's this beautiful yellow piece. There we go. Fabric number six, and look at the lines on this. I love this piece. It's one of my faves. And fabric number six has two yards. It has two yards. Do you have on your paper, Lynn, the yardage? Yes. So if I lose this paper, I'm good? Yes. Okay. I don't want you to get upset at me later and say, oh my God, now what do I do? <laughs> you have to go back and watch the video. Fabric number seven. For some reason today, I feel like I'm, this is the first time I'm doing a Facebook Live. I'm kind of, um, I feel like I'm discombobulated. But this is the first time we've done it this way. Maybe, the, maybe it's too bright outside and I just, I'm really like, it's thrown me off a loop. It's totally thrown me off a loop. What do you guys think? So fabric number seven has two and an eighth yards. Two and an eighth. Okay, fabric number eight has three. Did I skip one? Um, maybe, Connie. Mm -hmm. Connie, okay, so here's number six. Six is sold. This is seven. And then here is eight. Eight has three and an eighths yard. Maybe I said the wrong number or something, Connie, sorry. I told you I'm discombobulated today. No, I think it's me. <laughs> Connie, I think it's me. <laughs> I think I need to wake up. So Lynn got me a oat spiced latte drink. It's a cold drink. So maybe I need to have that. So number eight has three and an eighth yard of fabric. I love this um, stripe and it's very masculine. So mm -hmm. if you're looking for a fabric for a, um, the men exactly. in your life, yeah, yeah, it's perfect for that. And then also we've, we've taken our fabric and we folded it. Normally they're on a bolt. So I'm really like, it's, the whole thing has thrown me off, Lynn. I know, it's throwing you off your vibe. It's throwing me off my vibe. Okay, fabric number nine is three and an eighths also. I love this color. Fabric number nine, three and an eighths yard. Uh oh. Oh, well you tell Penny to hang tight Mom is shopping. She could have brought Penny here. I would have taken her, but she might not have brought that. <sighs> no, you just tell Penny Mama shopping. All right, here is number 10. 10 is three and two thirds yards. I love this one. I know. I Maybe I'll make a, a purse out of it. Or we could do a. Um, a blouse would be fun too. Mm -hmm. A lot of options, a lot of options. So that one is three and two thirds. Okay, my friends, moving right along, number 11. Number 11 has seven eighths yards. Number 11 has seven eighths yards.
Oh, that's a good one. Masks and apron, yep. I know, I gotta move all these fabrics so I have make room for more. I think I have another 12 boxes on the sales floor mm -hmm. that I need to open. You just emptied all of them and more came in. I know, I, I just emptied them, more came in, and yeah, so definitely need to make some more room. So this is number 11 and it's 7 8 yard. I love the Hawaiian looking tropical. Okay, my friends, it's batik time. Here is a batik print. Fabric number 12 has three and three quarter yards of fabric. Three and three quarter yards and it's a batik. I should move the mic lens so when you talk they can hear you too. Let me do that real quick. Excuse my hand, my friends. I'm moving the mic so that way you guys can hear Lynn as well. Oh, missing out here. Okay, so number 13. Number 13 has... I don't know how number 13 has. Whoops. How oh, much is in 13? Is two yards. 13 is two yards. 13's that. I missed number of those. That's the white with pink. Oh, wait. The white with the pink? So you have I'm two sorry, 13's. I have two 13's? Uh huh. Uh-oh. We'll go with that as 13. And then put no, that one aside, yeah. Oh, no, I'll just. You can't because it's you gotta put it at the very end. Could add it at the end. Yeah. Um so the white with pink bars is one of five eights. Oh sorry, this Why one here. Blue? Okay guys, sorry. White with pink flowers is number thirteen and it's one and five eighths. We are both messing up, Lynn. What's oh our story today? It was before you had the You've had caffeine, so what's your excuse? <laughs> <laughs> when, I, it was, when I was numbering, I didn't have this. Oh, uh, when you were numbering, you didn't have the caffeine. I got it. It was right after lunch. Big mistake. Big mistake to have it right after lunch. Okay, Lynn. Uh huh. Okay, fourteen. Number fourteen is one and one eighths. One and one eighths yard. Well, um, tell Diamond that thirteen did have a white. 13 does have a white background. Uh huh. Yes, I know, Laurel. I think I'm on holiday mode, but you know what? I, to be honest, Thanksgiving is never really, I mean, even though we get um, Thursday off, Friday and Saturday are crazy for us, right? So it never really feels like a holiday, but you're right. The fact that I get to um, relax tomorrow, I think I've already started. I think you should leave your phone up. I think I've already wound down. <laughs> I'm just not going to check my phone. That's what I'm going to do. So number 14 has one and an eighth yard. One and one eighth, Pam. Sorry. I'm rambling. Number 15. Number 15 has two and a quarter yards of fabric. Two and a quarter yards of fabric. Are there any good movies playing? I was thinking of taking the kids to the, well now I'm not gonna take them anywhere because they've already gone somewhere today. Yeah. I was gonna go to the movies tonight with them, maybe. I don't know if there's any good movies out though. Do you know? Seems like lately they haven't been here. Number 16 has three and a quarter yard. Three and a quarter yards of fabric. And you know, to be honest, I went to, uh, oh, Encanto, Dos Ghostbusters, oh. I actually went to um, the reclining theaters one time, big mistake. Did you fall asleep? No, I didn't fall asleep, but now I like <laughs> sitting in reclining chairs. I've actually known to fall asleep before, you're I right. I think I'd fall asleep. I have been known to fall asleep. Um, 
but I didn't this last movie I don't remember what the last movie was and um, and where was I going oh I just love the reclining chairs yeah so now I don't know if I can just go to a regular theater I mean I could of course but I prefer the reclining for the amount of times we go to the movies I think I'd rather pay the difference but um, okay so Encanto and Ghostbusters I gotta look into those that those those sound good so number 17 is two and two-thirds yards. Two and two-thirds yards of fabric. Number 18 has one and one-eighth. One and one-eighth yards. Number 18, one and one eighths yard. Number 19 has two and a half yards. Let's see if I can focus on it. There we go. Number 19 has two and a half yards. Is that not focused? You know what? It's the lines, Connie. <laughs> it's the lines. Because here's the next one. Number 20. Number 20 has three yards. And of course, I try to focus on one that has all these wavy lines. Not smart, huh? Well, you know, as Laurel said, I am on vacation mode already. I'm on that holiday mode. One day holiday. Well, it's nice to be able to not... Well, actually, this whole week, okay, my kids don't have school. Mm -hmm. So I don't have to get up early, too. So I've been kind yeah. of strolling in here a little bit later than I normally do. So did I tell you number 20 has three yards? Before I forget, let me tell... So the number 20 has three yards before I go on on my tangent about my kids. So yeah, it was, it's been nice. I don't have to get up early and take them to school, or at least one of them. So it's been fun to just kind of sleep in and not stress to get to work. Okay, number 21. 21 has two and a half yards. Two and a half yards. Two and a half yards. Twenty-two. I love this piece. If I can bring it real quick, let me turn it sideways so you guys can. Um, I'm just trying to see which way to show it to you guys. Let's do it this way. All right, twenty-two. So twenty-two has two yards. So all my Bernina lovers, twenty-two. Um. These are all Berninas. Lynn, can you name off the Berninas? Um, the one I'm pointing to? It's, which one are you pointing to? Because it's time to leave. Oh, is it time? Oh, the one, the big one with the embroidery. Oh, that's probably a 700 series. 790. Okay. okay. What about this one? The one next, the little one next to it? The mechanical. mechanical. Up above to the right. Above and to the right? Uh-huh. Right there. Oh, there you go. T what, is it? Eight, what is that one called? The 11... 1008. 10 10 yeah, 1008. Oh, 10 yeah. oh, 10 yeah. What about this one right below it, kind of at a cor at the uh, corner? Is it the 215? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And what about the last one, the middle, dead center one? The, um, like the 
three something? Kind of, right? Yeah. It was the 300 before the Look at this. We know our Berninas. <laughs> My dad would be proud. <laughs> so number 22 is two yards. Two yards. Oh, 350. That's it. Yeah, yeah that's 350. See, yep. we were in the ballpark. We were, we were in the ballpark. <laughs> We didn't hit the home run. No, no, nope. not this time. Okay, okay, let's get the next one real quick. Sorry, it's one and a quarter yards, number 23. So pretty and so feminine, I think. So delicate yeah, and dainty. Pretty. They make pretty Christmas stuff. Pillowcases. Pillowcases, yeah. And the pillow, last, uh, two years ago was the napkins, this year's pillowcases. I wonder what next year you're going to do. Maybe pajama bottoms. Oh, that'll be fun. That'd be cute. Yeah. And then they have to model it. <laughs> that wouldn't be a bad, bad thing. That'd be fun. I know. So 23 has one and a quarter yards. Or we could go to a certain store after dinner wearing our pajamas. Wearing the pajamas. <laughs> Well, you're lucky though. On Thanksgiving, a lot of stores are closing now. That's what, That's they what they're should. saying. That's what they, they should, should do. Yeah. It's fair, not fair to their no, it's fair. family time. Yeah. Okay, so 24 has one and two thirds yards. I love the rich roses. 25 has two and three eighths yards. I do love. Um, I do love um, taking the fabric off the bolts, though, for end of bolts. I know, it's better. I think it's easier. It's easier yeah. on the hands. Uh, no, Connie, it's, um, there is an embroidery, I think, I don't know what it's called exactly. So there's a, a, an embroidery program and um, each month there are different projects so they're probably they probably purchased the same program that we did and we're doing that yeah so no no they didn't take it that's funny though okay so 25 has two and three eighths yards but we, you, they don't have Lini teaching it Lini's exactly the best the Lini's the best they don't have Lini teaching it and you know, Lini's tips and tricks on on her little on her projects are invaluable. Fabulous. Invaluable. Okay, so twenty six has three yards. Twenty six has three yards. This would make nice napkins for the holidays. Very elegant. Or even a table runner. Placemats. Placemats, yep. All right, 27. 27 has one and a quarter yards. We're almost done with end of bolts. Then we have other fun stuff. I can't wait to show you. So 27 has one and a quarter yard of fabric. And this has metallic in it, metallic and white. I've got all these pins on this table. I better be careful. Yeah, I don't, don't want to pull a rayon. <laughs> Maybe it's a good thing he's not here. I know, because I think a couple of pins just fell on the floor. The other day they were doing something in the front yard and I'm like, why are you not wearing shoes? You know what, what happens to you. Yeah, he needs to wear steel toe boots <laughs> at all times. <laughs> he needs to wear <laughs> big time shoes. All right, number 28 is 7 eighths yards. For those of you who recognize, it's a Kimberbell fabric. So 7 eighths yards. This is their, from their candy corn collection this past um, October. Oh. You're pulling oh, over. Oh, Are you getting a ticket? Don't get a ticket for listening and driving. <laughs> okay, 
Well, yeah, you're pulling over because you can't type in the numbers while you're driving. So 28 has, what is it I say, 7 eighths yards. 29 has 2 yards. And I love this fabric if you want to practice your free motion quilting. I know. It's a good right? I wish I could quilt like that. That's for sure. I know. Well, we can with our embroidery machines. Yes, we can. You don't have to free motion. That's our kind of quilting. Oh, look, she pulled over so she could buy 29. <laughs> Elaine, you crack me up. Okay, number 30. Number 30 has, I don't know, I think it's three. Three yards. Three yards, yeah. Number 30 has three yards. Almost at the end, my friends. All right, 31, so 31, if you guys want to start in for next year's Halloween. I know, I love 30, the hearts for Valentine's. I love it. Because, you know, pretty soon Valentine's Day is like around the corner, I feel like. No. So 31 has three yards. And that one's gone. 32, 32 has one and a quarter yards of fabric. One and a quarter yard. 33 has one and two thirds yards. I love this color. That's pretty. It's a pretty, pretty shade. So 33 has one and two thirds yards. Thirty-four has three quarters yard. Is that right, Lynn? One yard. I think. Oh, one yard. I'm sorry. Thirty-four has one yard. Sorry. <laughs> I'm looking at the three and four, and I thought oh, it was okay. three quarters yard. <laughs> oh, never mind. Take a sip of latte. I'm taking a sip of my latte. I think I need to. As I'm picking up all my dropped pins. So 34 has one yards, my friend. And it's more like a, um, what color is that? I kind of said like a raspberry. Or like a raspberry? Not really raspberry. I don't know what to call it. Yeah. It's pretty, though. Okay, last but not least. Right, Lynn? 35? Yes, unless we want to remember this one. Oh, yeah, let's do that. So not last. So we have one more after that. Oh, raspberry, yeah. 35 is, um, I don't know how much. How much, how much yardage is on 35? Um, two and two thirds. Two and two thirds. Two and two thirds on this one. This so two and two thirds. And then now it's last but not least. Super fun print. This one here is two yards. 36 is two yards. 36 is two yards. Thirty-six is two yards. All right, so that's 36, and 36 was two yards. All right, so next I'm going to go ahead and um, show you. 
Let me change the banner real quick. We're going to jump right into Notions. And we're just adjusting one of our cameras. Give us a second here. I think you've got to turn it off and on. I did, and it's still. Yeah, turn it off. Wait a, wait a little. And that. Yeah, now try. Okay. So in the meantime, I'm going to, I think it's best if I open this one up. That way you can see all the fabrics. All right, so this one here. Oh, no sound. So look at the strawberries, look at the bananas. They are very vivid. And we are segueing this because we have all kinds of um, projects that um, we are going to use with this. It's very healthy, very healthy fat quarters. You're there absolutely you right. So this one here is A, and this one here is um, I can't find oh, my it's list. It's normally $49.99. But we're for $39.99. Okay, I'm just looking for my list. Though. Oh, here it is. Okay, my friends. So this one here, I've got plenty of these if you are interested. So this one here is normally $49.99 on sale for $39.99. And you guys are going to want these because look at this next project I'm showing you. And then I'm going to come back and show you the vegetable one. So these are the fruits. And then, yeah, absolutely great placemats. I've even seen a quilt with this, actually. Um, but look at this project. So this project is a casserole carrier. And you use these really super giant D-rings to um, close it up. So you, when you're going to a party or a gathering or whatnot, and then you just put it through. So it's really fun, and look at all the fun fabrics. So we used all of the fabrics here, and then we combined and we added some solids just to break it up a little bit, but you don't have to. And so we have this as well as a, um, we have the pattern, and the D-ring. So we'll come back and show you that. But I just wanted to show you how we used some of the fruit fabric. So fruit fabric was A. Then we have, let me open up this one. I think it's better when they're open because you need to be able to see all the fabrics. All right, so let me zoom back in. So these are all the veg, uh, not the veggies. Yeah, the veggies, I guess, right? Mm -hmm. The avocados, yep. Kale and peas and tomatoes and of course the usual peppers. Look at these. I mean, look at the oh, colors. The look so real. Yeah, look at the bell peppers. So super fun. So these oh, are cute. the veggie stack. So we've got a fruit stack and a veggie stack. And the uh, veggie stack is stack is B. And it is also the same price on sale for thirty nine ninety nine. So A is fruit, B is veggies. Okay. Then the pattern I showed you with the D-rings, those um, that's gonna be item C. So it's the pattern with the D-rings to make this casserole cover. And this is on sale for $4.79. So it includes the pattern and the two really big 
these are fat quarters, Elaine. These are all fat quarters. So there are, um, how many fat quarters did I say? Yeah, <coughs> 14. Yeah, oh, 14. 14 in each. Mm -hmm. 14 in each. So if you're interested in the pattern with the, the D rings, it's on sale for four seventy nine. Normally it's five ninety nine, and you can make this adorable little project. So my mom made this project. Um, she had so much fun doing it. She loves sewing for me. She does. Yeah, she loves sewing for me. It is kind of relaxing. It is relaxing. Okay. So now we're going to move on to Insulbrite because if you're going to do that casserole cover, you may need some Insulbrite to complete that project. So we have a package of Insulbrite. Normally it's $7.99 on sale for $6.39. So $6.39 is the Insulbrite. And that is item D. And next we have item E, which is the casserole dish hot pad. And so this actually includes the, the batting as well as the um, insole bright. So two pieces of batting in the insole bright, and they're already cut up, ready to go, so you guys can make your um, casserole dish hot pad. So this one here normally is um, nine dollars and ninety nine cents, and it's on sale for seven ninety nine. And this would be fun with some of that fabric as well. Okay, we are live, Ermi. All right, the next item is F, which is the plate cozy. So you can make um, the cozies to put around your dinner plate. And here there are um, eight in each package. So um, this one here is $19.99 and on sale for $15.99, and you can make eight of these. And again, perfect for the fruit fabrics or batiks or anything from your stash would be fun, or uh, you know, holiday-themed fabric, any of that good stuff. And there's eight of them in there. There's just it's just the batting on here, and then the directions, of course, how to how to put it together. Okay. Then my last item is a brand new item I just got in today, and I had to show it to you. So I'm gonna bring it over. Let's see if I can do this in a way that you guys can see this. And I don't know how I can do this, but it's a little light. Let me turn it on. You see how bright it is. It's a little portable light where you can um, use the, you can plug it in. So you can plug it in to charge it, then you can, you can walk around with it and put it wherever you need to do, wherever you need some extra light. As you can see, I'm moving my hands and see how, how bright it is. And the nice thing about this is this top piece swivels, so you can swivel it to whichever section you need to get some light. So for example, let me see, let me grab some fabric. Oops, you guys can't see that, oh, can you? Nice. But you can see that the light, you can really just, if you can see my, I don't know if you can, you can just tell, it's bright. Anyway, so we have this light, and then the nice thing about this is it folds. So then it folds, and then this comes down, and then it folds, and it sits in this adorable little case. So the case has a zipper. And then, of course, it's on right now. Let me turn it off. And then you just put it in here. 
and then zip it up. So it's super portable and fun to just kind of, if you need to put it in a different space or take it around. And this one, um, this one is on sale for $129.99. $129.99. It does not have a magnifier, it's just the light. Just the light. So there it goes, I put it away. Now I wanna use it, I just lift it up expand it and then twist it around and then I'll turn it on see how bright that is I love it okay so that's what I have um, let me go ahead and turn this camera around oh one second Okay, there we go. All right, my friends. So that's what we have today. Um, I hope you guys had a great time. Um, Laurel, it doesn't extend. It would extend to 12 inches. Oh, it does. Yeah. Oh, it does. Laurel. <laughs> oh, so Laurel. It's Here it is. Big. Look, it this it extended. Where's my camera? Go down. It did. It extended to 12. I love it. 12 inches? 12 feet? 12 inches. 12 inches. <laughs> <laughs> my so eyes. I, if I were nice, I'd get it one for each of my sewers tomorrow, but no, I don't think so. No, not a, no. But this is super fun. Now it's like, oh my it's goodness. It's a daylight one, right? It is. It's made by daylight. Yeah, it, those are um, the best. Yeah, they're the best. They are 6,000K daylight LEDs, full-size folding desk lamp. Um, supplied with the carrying case. I love it. Great Christmas gift. Great Christmas gift. Okay. Thanks, Laurel. As you can tell, we just got it in today, so I, I barely just charged it and played around with how to fold it away. All right. Anybody else have any other questions or anything else I can answer for you? You guys were the best. Thank you guys for joining us at a new time today. Sorry about that. Um, we just wanted to um, have all of our staff get home at a decent hour and spend time with their family and get ready for tomorrow, right? Got to kind of mentally prepare to eat all that turkey. Or steak. Or steak. Lynn's not eating turkey. Lynn's eating steak. Oh, yeah, it is a great break between cooking. I totally agree. Between cooking, between cleaning the house, all that oh, stuff, yes. right? I know. Maybe I should stay here longer so I don't have to go home and clean or anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. Happy Thanksgiving. Back to Florida address. Oh, okay. oh my goodness. Okay. So Happy Thanksgiving, Thanksgiving, Connie. Thank you. Oh, you need to bake your pies. Oh, there's so many bakers here. I love it. You guys are so talented. Multi-talented, huh? My mom was the baker. She baked your mom did right yeah you guys are so talented mm. um not online diamond no thanks Jeannie thanks Laurel thanks Deborah it's good to see you guys but I will have surprises on Black, um, Black Friday. So keep tuning in to Facebook. We, we will have stuff going on. We're going to have some pop-ups. And when you see the pop-ups, um, you can just order right there as well, right, with us. So it doesn't necessarily have to be on our website. We'll just do our pop-ups, and then you can order online that way with us. So a lot of opportunities on Friday as well. Oh, let's see what um, D pumpkin bread. Ooh, pumpkin bread. Pumpkin Kathy, bread. Kathy, cranberry and pineapple sauce done. Yams done and jello mold. Oh my goodness, you guys yeah, crack me up. I'll have to make these roll tonight and early tomorrow to bake lots of rolls. Oh my goodness, you guys crack me up. You guys are so talented and so patient. Baked lots of rolls. I'm um, to their house. I know, yeah, we're coming over. <laughs> oh, Fancy Pants. I heard she's an excellent baker. Yeah, Fancy Pants did that. Mm -hmm. Thank you, you guys. You guys have a wonderful, wonderful Thanksgiving. Stay safe. It's a little crazy out there, I heard, on the roads. huh? Be careful. 
it's just crazy. Um, Nancy, I think I know who you're talking to, Nancy. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys are funny. All right, I guess I don't have anything else. Me neither, huh? That's about it. We have a lot to be thankful for, though. We do. We have a lot to be thankful for. We have all for. these wonderful customers. Yeah, you guys are awesome. You guys are awesome. So we have a lot to be thankful for. So thank you guys so much for all of you guys. Um, yeah, we are truly blessed. Truly. Our second family. Yeah, our second family. We, things could have been a lot worse these past couple of years, let me tell yeah. you. Mm -hmm. I've heard stories, and we are just truly blessed. Okay, let's see. Oh, Laurel, you know what, Laurel? I got a citizen alert about winds today, this morning, first thing in the morning. Wow, so you have winds there, huh? Nancy, yes, I do, yeah. People are pulling over for imaginary sight. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. I love it. Things that my customers do for us. <laughs> Thanks, Elaine. Yeah, D Dorothy, I it's been it's been a it's been a tricky couple of years but you know what we are still here and we are still we are still thriving thanks to you guys our doors are still open and we are just super blessed to have all of you guys and it's because of you guys that we are here we couldn't do it alone if it was just me and Lynn you know, know we'd have fun but yeah, that doesn't pay the bills <laughs> no. oh thanks Ermi. I, I appreciate that i appreciate that it's been good it's been really good and you know what next year it can only get better no only get better hopefully we'll get back to our in-person classes Yay. that's the goal absolutely we'll still so do virtual for out of town friends. yes we'll still do virtual we'll virtual will never go away but we were gonna we're gonna add back in our um our in-store we miss the in-store as well yeah yeah <laughs> thanks Dorothea all right I guess that's it my friends you guys take care have a wonderful wonderful Thanksgiving and we shall chat with you guys um, yeah reinvented yes yes for sure for sure um, you know what you just what's that word that everybody's using you just got to yeah, pivot <laughs> you just got to pivot and we definitely pivoted and we're going to continue to pivot so absolutely absolutely yes virtual for sure connie it's not going to go away yep yeah so we're going to do both we're going to do both but we're, we're shooting for january to get back in here and get some classes and eventually get our events back in here so that's our goal um so yeah thank you guys um i was going to say something i was looking at the comments and i was going to say something but Okay, that being said, we will see you guys Friday. So stay tuned Friday on Facebook. We will be popping in and our first pop in will be at nine o'clock, which is our normal Friday fun day. We're not gonna necessarily have a Friday fun day, um, but we will pop in to show you some things. So um, please join us, okay? And you guys have fun tomorrow with your family. Stay safe and we'll chat soon. Bye.